Of course, you are in here. Well, why wouldn't I be? Okay. Look at this. We're going to have to turn off the air conditioner. Sorry. Well, that's the thing. There's cold, cold AC. I'm surrounded by a tropical place that's somewhere else, right? Like you're just instantly someplace else in the camper. I love it. Perfect for reading. We're gonna vlog today. Do I have something in my teeth? No. I was eating the Bones coffee beans earlier. They almost taste better eaten than brewed. You can really taste the flavor if you eat the beans. I don't know what's wrong with you. Are you ready to do this? Yes. Hey, what's up, family? I'm Rachel. And I'm Joe. And we're Two, Two Crazy, Crazy Ketos. Ketos. And if you're new to our channel, welcome. Here on Two Crazy Ketos, we do different things, like recipe videos, we do product reviews, we talk about various keto topics, and then every Monday, we sit down on the couch for Keto on the Couch. We just kind of talk about what's going on in our lives for the week. You can find us in different social media platforms like Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And we have a website, which is 2crazyketos.com. That's where you're going to find all of our different recipes. Now, we do upload at least five new videos every single week, so make sure you subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to hit the little bell icon, and that way every single time we upload a new video, you'll be alerted to it. So, it is a busy day. It is Wednesday right now. It is the first day of school for our nephews. Mm -hmm. And in an unprecedented turn of events, this is actually year two, that we are not beginning like a back to school thing with little kids. That's true. It feels weird. Instead, we're planning a vacation. How upside down is that? We're sitting in a camper right now in our driveway. You know... You keep coming out here. You want to sleep in here every time I set it up to work on it. I do. You're drinking coffee out here. I am. You're reading your book. You you brought the coffee, though. When code enforcement comes and knocks on my door, I can tell them, hey, we're going on vacation. I'm just prepping. I'm working on it. But I can't say that when it's obvious that you're living in here. <laughs> When I come out in pajama pants and, like, fuzzy slippers, like, yeah, it's pretty obvious. Like, right now, I could probably pull off. They're like, hey, I'm going someplace else. Look, I'm I'm active. But I wear active wear way more than I'm actually active. I'm just wearing the active wear. So, we have a busy day. This is the day of making videos. Yes. We're going to vlog the day. We're going to do a full day of eating vlog. Okay. We are... We have to do, I have to do the keto box video with Anthony. Poor thing. All those snacks. Uh, we're, we have to do a Costco haul. Yes, because we do need food for this trip. Yep. And we also are going to film a video like about like the changes of the campers, like our process of getting the camper, what it looked like, and what it looks like now. And then I have three weeks worth of church curriculum videos to edit. And I need to prep enough boxes and shipping materials for the boys to take over for me in case we get a landslide of shipping while we're gone. So I finished my Zoom call, looking like a hot mess. I employ a lot of hats and scarves during Zoom calls. Do you guys do that? Like, I'm trying to distract from the fact that I have not adulted yet this morning. But anyway, I got through that. Then I took the shipping to the post office and to FedEx. And now if I had good sense, I would go home and make myself presentable. But alas, I am obviously not adulting quite yet. So I'm gonna sneak into my local thrift store and see if there is a top that I can purchase for under $5 because yeah, why not? And I am enjoying some Bones Banana Foster coffee. I can't believe I made a pot of coffee last night and did not consume the entire thing, but I did have some leftover coffee. I'm drinking it over ice and I am loving it. I can't believe I waited so long to try Bones coffee, but I'm enjoying it now. If you like bananas, I think you'll like the bananas foster. If you don't like bananas, do not get it because it is very banana-y. So I'm heading into Bass Pro Shops because there's a few things I wanna get for the trip. I wanna get a uh, portable fire ring, like a gas powered fire ring, and I'm also looking for some enamel plates. So I did not find a top because I was completely distracted by their books 
section at this thrift store. It was amazing. I did not realize how much I have been missing just going to the library. I just miss going to the library and wandering around and finding new fun books. So I got 28 books for $11. How awesome is that? And I got some really fun ones like the book of useless information. Does this not seem like it is up my alley? Let's see. What's a useless bit of uh, information? Kotex was first manufactured as bandages during World War II. Yep, that's a fun fact I did not know. And now every single time I see a maxi pad, I'm going to be thinking about World War II. Okay, so yeah, so many fun books at the thrift store. Well, they don't have much of a selection here. And unfortunately, they only have one bowl and we need two. They have the plates, but the rest of this stuff, we don't really need much of this. These Goal Zero portable power stations are supposed to be really good, but they don't have the one that I want. The one that we're looking to eventually get is the 500 watt one, but these things are really, really awesome. I have the cutest sous chef today. You're such a good girl. So helpful in the kitchen. Such a good cook. So easy. Even Tabitha can do it. Okay, this meal prep is so easy. I think probably she could do it. So it is just now 11 o'clock and I'm already prepped for the day. I highly recommend not prepping your food during your eating window because I am very guilty of playing one for dinner, one for the cook. So if I you know, prep my food, not in my eating window, I won't eat anything. It's, it's amazing how that happens. So, okay, one of my goals for today is eat your meal prep. So that's what we're gonna do. I definitely think it's a good thing to have a meal prep day when you're going to Costco because yeah, I wanna eat all the food when I'm there, but if I have to eat my meal prep, then I don't have any negotiation room for, for me to try to weasel in some extra food. Tabitha knows that I am about to go give the girls a snack and she doesn't like anybody getting food that's not her. So yeah, it's 11.30. Time for the girls to have a little snack. We're gonna have some grapes. Of course, we've got to share our grapes with Grayson, because he likes grapes too. Here we go. And I'm sure the girls will be, yep, they're waiting for their snack. And it's so funny. I was late the other day and Bessie just walked right through that dog door to say, hey, we want our snack. Where is my snack? So we're gonna sit down over here. I just go barefoot. I'm like Dr. Pole. It's so much easier to clean me off versus my shoes. So here we go. They absolutely love these grapes, especially because it is a hot day. They act like they have never eaten before and they get <laughs> snacks all the time. But that is chickens, man. They are always wanting to eat. Bessie wants a little bit of snuggles. It's snuggle time. Hello. Can I say hi to everybody? Hi, everybody. They're super inquisitive. We always change things up around the yard because they just love exploring stuff. I super glued my fingers. How did you do that? I was trying to attach those things with super glue and yeah, I super glued my fingers. Nail polish remover though got them apart. So that's good. Your new washing machine is here. My washing machine, I just need a bucket and some soap. Do you know how bad that looks right now? Well, it's not a plunger. <laughs> It's a washing machine. We should hand that to the kids and say, hey, this is how you have to do all your own laundry for no one. This or rock. So while I was out, I got something from somebody on OfferUp. Oh no, you didn't. Six bucks, OfferUp. Okay, so $6, I feel like you can get $6. Like that's, and what does it do? It, like... it shoots salt. Ooh. We do have, Two flies 
that are like Top Gun flyers. Like they're so good at evading my tennis racket and my spray bottle. And so, yeah, I'm ready. Let's see how bad this works. I don't see them right now. They're waiting. They're laying in wait. Want to see what we got for the camper today? Is this the camper baby shower? Kind of. You get the camper cheap, but it's the accessories. It's always the accessories for anything that's going to get you. Look, I actually boxed up the sewing machine so it could go away for another five years. We'll see you in our next renovation. I even put away the iron. I think that was the first time the iron's been out in like 10 years. It was absolutely shocked that it was being used. Probably like now has stories to tell. Even in here. She has to be in the video. She's got to be in the video. Anthony's going to get the fly. <laughs> you look like Rambo. By your head. Oh gosh, don't shoot me in the head. Oh. You missed. I feel like I'm going to lose an eye. <laughs> don't shoot the cat. He's over there. Oh, oh, there's two of them. You're missing. This is too hard. I thought you played video games. He's over here. Oh, he's like right by this. Right, there you go. Wait till he lights. I got it. You got it. Did you actually you got it. Look, he's on the chair. You stunned him. Kill him. Wow. Whoa, it works. Wait, it worked. It Anthony killed it. a fly. All of those hours of video games has given your mother peace. What are you wearing? So I've already packed my rain jacket for camping, the one that I actually wear now. So I had to bust out one from my before keto days. So this is an old rain shirt that fit before I lost my weight. The scary part is I seem to remember it was kind of tight. It was tight. It wasn't even a jacket. It was really like a, you know, a cardigan that you would have to open up. So it's interesting because we haven't camped in a really long time. I hadn't tried this thing on. It was just buried in the back of my closet. So yeah, wow, we've come a long way, baby. So we just finished going to Sam's Club and Publix to get probably what, 90% of what we're gonna eat for the camping say, trip? I would say, yeah, we didn't even have to go to Costco. Yeah, we were gonna go to Costco, but they pretty much had everything that we wanted at Sam's Club. The biggest thing I wanted at Costco was the Costco hot dogs, but Sam's Club had a Members Mark cheddar sausage, which I kind of want to have one for dinner, but we I know you've got some awesome meal prep. We have to eat our meal prep. But they look really, really good, and the ingredients were pretty clean, and I think it was like three total carbs per sausage, but that's, they have jalapeno in them, they have cheese, and that's one thing about, we saw, when you compare it to the Kielbasa brand, yeah. Right? So you look at the Kielbasa brand and you're like, oh, it's only one carb per sausage. It's not. Because By the ounces. It's serving size is two ounces and the average sausage is four ounces. <sighs> you always have to be on your toes. You have to be on your toes. So we just finished that, but I just wanted to say I wore a rain jacket because when we left the house. Pouring. It was pouring. Rachel's wearing a giant tomato costume. <laughs> It was my old rain jacket because I've already packed all of my current fitting rain jackets and I had this in the back of the closet. But boy, it really puts things in perspective. Sometimes it takes putting on one of your old shirts to see how far you've come. Yeah. So what I was getting to was, we, of course we wore raincoats, which we never wear raincoats. But that stopped the rain though. Yeah. So we've been walking around with raincoats on all afternoon. Like idiots. And it hasn't rained. I know it's been a long day. Sorry about the sun, but I'm hungry. I'm hungry too, but I'm going to quickly fry up our dinner because everything's already prepped and ready to go. It's like 7.30 and the only thing I've had is that little bite of keto brick. So you do that. I'll take this thing down. I'm hungry. I got you covered. It is 7.09. I'm just going to fry this up really good and then add our meat to it and you will be good to go, sir. What about my wings? Ooh, I better put this in the toaster oven. So it is 7.25 and I am done with dinner. So browned up this stuff. I just turned off the stove. I like to pour the hamburger mixture over top of the salad. I know it's gonna wilt the lettuce, but we love that. It soaks up all of the fat. The only other thing that we are waiting for is the wings. So we're gonna have a combination of wings and 
this beautiful giant salad. All done and ready to go before Joe has even collapsed the trailer. Well, I had to wait for Joe to put the trailer down. Oh, there's a fly. Shoot it. Where is he? Shoot it. You know what the hardest part about finding these flies are? Like, they get close to you and then you can't shoot them. Look, there he is. Don't shoot our camera. Where'd he go? Now I lost them. They know. They know. There he goes. Oh well. It's dinner time. Finally. I am ready. It has been a productive day. This looks like the giantest of giant salads ever. Yes, before everybody starts putting in the comment section below, like, how are you guys eating so much food? Number one, this is our first and only meal of the day other than that bite of keto brick that I had today, which was probably like 100 calories. It was literally a bite. It wasn't even like the size of a puck. And I had water and coffee. But it's ground beef, which is, this is what, like less than three quarters of a pound, because I think each package is only like one and a half pounds. And mostly lettuce. But still, it was only a half of a small head of lettuce together right so one fourth of a small iceberg lettuce you just have to dice it up yeah and yes iceberg lettuce is mostly water i like the crunch factor then we're having some leftover wings i don't even know if i'm going to eat all this but this either. is my food and then if i eat it i eat it if i don't it goes in the refrigerator and i can eat it tomorrow but again this is our only meal and this is what's been working whether we eat it all now or we eat it over a few hours I'm down to 191 pounds. You're doing really well with your weight. I don't know what your weight's at. But. So I had topped out at 162. Mm -hmm. I'm now down to 152. Very, it's like 0.1. So right. I'm like very close to 151 again. My like totally awesome, amazingly super skinny size for me was like 146. Right. So I'm really close to my all time low. You're looking really skinny. And I feel really good. I feel energized all day long. Certainly we had a lot of things just kind of spring up Yep. and we didn't go off plan. That's we right. went, we were able to go grocery shopping. We had somebody come and visit. We had like a hassle from a code enforcement, no matter what, if it was a good stress or a we bad stress. We didn't even stress, do anything wrong for those of you who are going like code enforcement. We, we didn't promise. do anything wrong. We actually just have somebody that reports us for everything. Like garbage men forgot to take the garbage and he calls code enforcement on us. And the code enforcement people are like, we understand you have like a crazy person living and like calling on you all the time. But yeah, I got, I've got to like, I don't know, make him a casserole or something. Make him a steak, make him some bacon, Joe. But we yeah. We did forget to get bacon for our camping trip. We made plenty of bacon. I probably got 50 pounds of bacon. So we're we got, covered. We, we've got bacon, but we didn't put that in that video. Well, that is going to be our full day of eating for the day. Uh, I'm looking forward to eating. By the way, I'm drinking a cola Zevia, Aldi Zevia. And our new little tiny Berkey came with like the cutest little tiny glass. So I'm enjoying it. If you like seeing these full day of eating videos, make sure you take a look at the entire playlist, which you can find right down there. And don't forget to check out our most recent video, which you're gonna find right over there. But whether you check out this or you check out that, don't forget to do this. Subscribe to our channel and hit the little bell icon. That way every single time we have a massive plate of food, you'll be alerted to it. Until next time. Bye. Bye.